What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for dreams. This is free general collective reading for all um, for the side of Pisces for July 2022. This can resonate if you have Pisces in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, no Moon, Hand, Venture, Charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. It does not apply at fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading for Sign of Pisces. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. We're, ooh, Lord. We're at 12,340 subscribers right now. So thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. I updated my where I'm at on the Yelp. Um, Yelp site right now. They have currently not activated my account, but I don't want to pay for advertisements. And they were asking for a business website, but it says optional on my end. So I'm not stressing about it. It is what it is. I mean, it'd be nice to have it up there, but um, I, hell, I have, haven't had it up there before. So it's not like it hasn't helped me in the past. So not having it up there is the same as it is now. So, I mean, you know what I'm saying? Um, but love you guys so much. If you like to donate, it's High Priestess Row by the links in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. I do not publicly display your name. Uh, your name. Well, not your name. Yeah, I don't publicly display your name. Um, how much you donate, sometimes I do. Depending. Okay. This can resonate, resonate if you have Pisces in any aspects of your charts. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, or charts. It's a free general collective reading, so it's very important to only take the messages that resonate with the rest. For some, you could be dealing with a fire sign or another water sign. If you are, they could have um, Aries, Leo, Sag, or Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, No, Manhattan, or Jupiter charts. You plug it in how it resonates. Um, I received two channel messages in, and I'll, as I was meditating on your July 2022's energy, Pisces, I heard peaches and cream was the first one. Let me make sure my volume's up. Confirmation from Fat Boy, by the way. I heard peaches and cream was the first one, and the second one I heard a significant lawsuit soon. So peaches and cream and a significant lawsuit. So maybe you like peaches and cream, or somebody you're connected to likes peaches and cream. Or you have peaches and cream scented something, or somebody you're connected to does. Um, however, or however that resonates. Um, maybe you like peaches and cream edibles in the bedroom. I mean, I don't know. You plug it in how it resonates, Pisces. Um, and um, a significant lawsuit soon. So, some kind of significant lawsuit, whether. You are involved in this lawsuit in the legal sector, or you are placing a lawsuit on person, people, place, or situation, or someone's placing it on you. You plug it in, how it resonates. Spirit messages you have, it's not a face. Number 12 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 12, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, or any other significant number in one's life. Number 12. Needle and thread, a sincere wish will be granted. Flute, disappointment in a friend or lover, broken wishbone, wish will not be granted. We have the temple path, white dress, lizard, oyster.
A fire sign is about to completely change their look. It's about to shock the hell out of you. Yeah, I heard a fire sign is about to completely change their look. It's about to shock the hell out of you. So some kind of fire sign energy, they're about to completely change their look. It's about to shock the hell out of you. So lizards um, in the wild, their uh, skin changes different colors, um, like chameleon S type energy. Um, so I think this is your fire sign about to change their look. I think it's going to be aesthetic look. It could be hair. It could be glasses. It could be tattoos. It could be um, removal of tattoos. It could be piercing or piercings. Um, it could be a plethora of different things. I think it's aesthetically something. It could be dress the way they dress. How that resonates. I heard it's going to shock the hell out of you. Uh, it could be Aries Leo Sag. They could have Aries Leo Sag and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Mid, Hammer, Jupiter charts. It's somebody you're dealing with in some shape, form, or fashion, Pisces. I feel they could be masculine or feminine. And a Pisces is about to change their look. Completely change it up. And a Pisces is about to completely change their look. About to completely change it up. So for some, you're a fire sign. You're connected to in some shape, form, or fashion is going to masculine or fem, Aries, Leo, Sag, and for some you are. So, um, however you're going to change up your look, I feel it's aesthetic. Um, whatever this look is, and how they um, however it resonates for you, I feel it could be piercings, tattoos, makeup, or hairstyle style change, or tattoo, or tattoos, or dress, or what have you, what have you. I don't know. You only, you know, not anybody else. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Oyster. A bombshell. Is coming soon. A bombshell. Bombshell truth. Bombshell truth is coming soon. Bombshell truth. So some kind of bombshell truth. Um, it could be the pearl in the oyster. That's the bombshell truth. I feel for some of you guys. I think it's the pearl in the oyster. Maybe it's coming from a fire sign or a um, water sign. Maybe some kind of bombshell sh shell truth. Whatever the hell that is and however it resonates. How that resonates, Pisces? Some kind of bombshell truth. You could be delivering this bombshell truth, or somebody's delivering it to you, or it could be about you. I mean, I'm not sure. Some kind of bombshell truth energy. You plug it in, how it resonates. Oyster. A Pisces masculine is about to meet the love of his life. The love of his life. True love here. Twin flame connection. Oh, see, I love to hear things like this. A Pisces masculine. So you haven't met her yet, Pisces masculine. Um, you haven't met her yet. Um, sounds like it's upcoming in the universe. Um, it's a femme energy, so it's not homosexual. It's femme. Um, heterosexual to homosexual. Um, it's femme energy, and I heard she's going to be the love of your life. Twin flame connection. So. It's not a false twin flame. It's not somebody doing it out of control and manipulation and money reasons and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. It's true love. It will be true love between you and her. Um, she's going to be your pearl in the oyster, sir. You haven't met her yet. You go with your bad self if this resonates for you. So in this aspect, it's your pearl in the oyster, sir. Hopefully you treat her like a pearl in the oyster. Um, because there are things called divorces, if anybody needs to hear that, okay? I mean, I'm not saying you're going to marry her, but, um, just saying, just saying. A Pisces is about to find out about a very abusive Sagittarius feminine. They are about to come after this person legally. A Pisces is about to find out about a very abusive Pisces femme. They're, I meant not a Pisces femme. Very abusive Sag femme. 
they're going to come after this Sag Finn legally. So um, maybe she has abused you, sir, or she's about to abuse you, or she's abused somebody you care about, um, or maybe your child or children. I didn't hear that was the case. But somehow you're about to find out about the Sagittarius Femme, very abusive Sag Femme, and you're about to come after her legally. So I think she's about to abuse you or abuse somebody you care about or 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 some something, however that resonates. But you're about to find out about her abusiveness, and basically you're about to come after her legally. I feel for some of you could be a lawyer or or not. I don't know. Um, I hope that resonates. Um, you are the pearl and the oyster in this aspect because you're about to take some action, sir. The temple path. Many decisions coming soon. Many. Many decisions coming soon. Many. So some of you guys have many decisions coming soon. So you have many decisions coming soon. Um, different paths, different options, different um, ways you can go, many avenues. I mean, options, options, options here, which everybody loves options for real, for real, for real. So absolutely freaking uh, absolutely so options here different paths different choices temple path you plug it in how it resonates And a Pisces masculine lawyer, your client, Gemini masculine, has a plan to get somebody to call Child Protective Services on his ex-wife. However, it's going to turn around in a huge way. Know this. Okay, so you're a Pisces masculine lawyer, if that resonates for you, and you have a Gemini masculine client. And I heard he has a plan, a game plan, to basically have somebody call Child Protective Services on his ex-wife. Um, but I heard basically it's going to, it's about to seriously backfire, seriously. Okay, I heard it's about to seriously backfire, seriously. So the plan's about to seriously backfire. Um, I'm assuming she is not an unfit mother. Um, I'm assuming she's not over there shooting up meth in her veins or sorting up coke or, um, doing heroin or abusing prescription pain pills or, I, or, I don't know, or what have you, or what have you, uh, will cause somebody to get their children taken away as an unfit mother. Um, I'm assuming she keeps her lights on, has food in the refrigerator, and takes care of her children the appropriate way she's supposed to. So, because um, I heard it's going to seriously backfire. So, I'm assuming she doesn't physically assault them, or what have you, what have you, so it's going to backfire. Um, you are a Pisces masculine lawyer. You're dealing with a Gemini masculine client and apparently he has it out for his ex-wife. It's about the money and you know this. It's about to seriously backfire. It's about the money and you know this. It's about to seriously backfire. So the choice that your client is about to make here, he hasn't made it yet and he's about to, heard it's about to seriously backfire. And it's going to look really bad. Know this really bad okay i heard it and it's going to look really bad really bad know this so it's going to look really bad it sounds like he's your current client so it sounds like um you're in a current uh case with him um and it's probably regarding child custody issues or something of that nature because i heard his ex-wife so um you plug it in how it resonates, sir. You're a Pisces masculine lawyer dealing with a Gemini masculine client. A job offer coming soon in a 
from an out-of-state area. A job offer coming soon from an out-of-state area is what I heard. So the typical path, a job offer coming soon from an out-of-state area. So options, decisions, some kind of job offer coming soon from an out-of-state area. That could be for you or somebody you're connected to. White dress. A wedding is about to come very significant in Pisces' life. A Pisces is about to get married. And a Pisces is about to propose. Okay, I heard a wedding is about to come significant in Pisces' life. And a Pisces is about to get married. And um, a Pisces is about to propose. So you plug it in how it resonates. Uh, I feel you can be masculine or feminine with the proposal because we're 2022. Women propose to men all the time now. Um, and that's just the truth. So, how would that resonate, sir, ma'am? Um, uh, I think one of you guys is about to go to a wedding. You're about to go to a wedding, seeing the white dress go down the aisle. One, you're about to um, get married. So, you could be a femme or a masculine, but white dress energy. Now, whether they earn the white dress or not, I don't know. <laughs> um, and for one, um, you're, um, you're about to propose. I mean, I'm sorry. Well, proposal energy. So, whether you're proposing or blase, blase, blase. A femme energy reader, not not paying attention to any giving any attention to a particular serious situation of the past is about to seriously piss off an air sign feminine you are connected to her you're about to hear this secretly behind the scenes in a huge way it's about to be so annoying okay i heard a fem energy reader online popular social media platform online popular social media platform so you have an air sign fan friend um and she apparently watches readings i'll tell you that now she could be a reader or not i didn't hear she was but she definitely watches readings i'll tell you that um tear online popular popular social media platform people readings um so she watches them online but like i said she could be a reader or not i don't know but this fem reader online popular social media platform i heard is currently um, not giving any more attention to a very serious situation in the past and she's not doing it on her platform now is what it sounds like but it's pissing off your air sign fem but she's it's pissing her off behind the scenes so she's not going to speak on it publicly um i'm presuming um she's going to bitch and gripe and complain to you i heard behind the scenes i heard it's going to annoy the hell out of you so you could be a masculine or femme Pisces. I don't know. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. See, I that's I couldn't deal with friends like that. I'd just block them out because that's annoying as hell. And that's just the truth. But you plug it in how it resonates. It's going to cause you to separate yourself from this person. It's going to be so annoying. One, you're going to feed into it. Okay, I heard one you're going to feed into it and one it's going to cause you to separate yourself from this person because it's going to be so annoying. So it sounds like that's all we're going to want to talk about. But it's going to be behind the scenes. It's not going to be like publicly, like shouting it to the masses. Um, they might have a public platform or not. But if they do or don't, they're not going to shout it to the mass masses. Uh, and that's just the truth. They're going to want to just bitch and gripe and complain to you. For one, you're going to feed into it. So feed right in back onto it. One, you're not, and I heard it's going to cause you to separate yourself away. So, you plug it in how it resonates, but it sounds like this popular online social media platform person is doing that for reasons. And I'm just being real. Needle and thread, a sincere wish will be granted.
a delivery soon. And for one, a neighbor is going to deliver you very important information. A delivery soon, and for one of you guys, a neighbor is going to deliver you very important information. So for one of you guys, a delivery soon, and for one of you guys, a neighbor is going to deliver you very important information. So you plug it in how it resonates. So wish will be granted, the neighbor delivering you very important information for one, and for one, a delivery. So you plug it in how it resonates. Flute, disappointment in a friend or lover. Airs up. No, sorry, not air sign. Earth sign masculine. Erectile dysfunction. Okay, I heard it. Earth sign masculine, erectile dysfunction. So some kind of earth sign masculine has erectile dysfunction. Um, that could be your friend or your lover. Um, I'm feeling some kind of earth sign masculine has erectile dysfunction. That could be your friend or lover or somebody you're connected to's friend or lover, but some kind of, uh, I think at this point to you, this earth sign masculine has erectile dysfunction or he's about to learn he does. I think for a lot of you guys, it's your married spouse or your lover or a committed partner or boyfriend, girlfriend or something like that. Or boyfriend, not girlfriend. Uh, you plug it in, how it resonates. And a betrayal from a co-worker is about to become very significant in Pisces' life. One, they're going to request to transfer units. And a betrayal from a co-worker is about to become very significant in Pisces' life. For one of you guys, it's going to um, cause you to transfer units or request to transfer units. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Um, broken wish, well, nobody likes to be disrespected or betrayed or lied to and um etc 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 so um you have to do what you have to do broken wishbone wish will not be granted There's about to be a very significant court loss soon. You thought it was going to be a court win. It's about to blindside you in a huge way. You are a lawyer. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. Um, I didn't hear if you're a masculine or femme lawyer. You can be a masculine or femme lawyer. Um, I heard there's about to be a very significant court loss soon. I heard you thought you were going to win, but it's about to blindside you and you're not going to win. Um, so you thought you had this in the bag. I think you are, I heard a lawyer. So you're either a lawyer, Pisces lawyer, or you, um, or you are dealing with a lawyer. How that resonate? Some kind of legal situation here. So you're either a Pisces lawyer or you, um, uh, or a Pisces in a legal situation. I feel it can go both ways. You plug in how it resonates. Because I heard um, lawyer. So you're either dealing with a legal situation with a lawyer or you are a Pisces lawyer. Uh, masculine or femme. How this resonates. But I heard basically there's about to be a very significant court, um, court situation coming up soon. I think you were either the legal. You're in the legal party with this. Or the lawyer. Or a, a lawyer. Or... Um, um, the plaintiff or defendant, how that resonates. But I heard you thought you were going to win, um, but you're not. It's about to be a blind side. It's actually about to go completely the other way. Completely. It's about to shock the hell out of you.
is actually about to go completely the other way. It's about to shock the hell out of you. So whoever you are, um, sorry, ma'am, um, it's, it's about to shock you. It's actually about to go completely the other way. So wish will not be granted. You, um, you thought you were going to win this case or win um, or et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, where you're the plaintiff, the defendant, or a lawyer or lawyers, uh, but it's actually going to go, I heard, completely the other way blindside so it sounds like it's going to be completely blindsiding and it's about to go completely the other way so you plug it in how it resonates wow let me pull one kipper can i see if you have a budget? Privileged lady, number 12, could be very significant number in one's life. Number 12, you plug it in, how it resonates. It could be a significant number of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number in one's life. For some, you are the privileged lady. For some, you know a privileged lady. This person is about to become very significant in your life. Some in a positive way, some in a negative way. Okay, I heard for some you are the privileged lady, for some you know a privileged lady, and um, for some of you guys, uh, the one you know is about to become a very integral part in your life soon. So, privileged lady energy, whether you are this person or you know this person. For some, you could be a, a masculine takes on them energy um, as a privileged lady, possibly. For some, you are this person, for some, you know this person. Um, but whether you are this person or know this person, um, they're about to become a very integral part of your life soon, some in a positive way, some in a negative way. An illegal case study of a family is about to become very significant in a court situation soon. It's about to shock the hell out of one of these court situations. They didn't think it would come up. Okay, I heard an illegal case study is about to become very integral in one of these court situations. It's about to shock the hell out of one of these. So there's several legal situations in here. And one of these, it sounds like an illegal court situation, uh, illegal case study of a family in the past is about to come up. And it's about to shock the hell out of people in this court situation. Because I heard they didn't think it was going to come up, but I heard it is going to come up. And it is about to blow the lid off this shit. Blow it off. And it's about to blow the lid off this shit. Blow it off is what I heard. So it's about to blow this case wide open. Um, I might be the one that's going to be blindsided. You plug it in how it resonates, you guys. Wow. Private school for one Pisces. Private school for one Pisces. So you could be in private school or, well, I hope you're 18 plus reviewing these. But um, for one, maybe you're in private school or you have a child or children in private school or you know connected to somebody that has a child or children in private school. Somehow private school is significant. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates. Peonies are significant to a Pisces. And peonies are significant to a Pisces. So private school and peonies are significant to at least one of you guys. You plug it in how it resonates. Peonies are a flower for anybody who doesn't know that. All right. Love you guys so much. Have a good day. Namaste.